All right, guys, if you like thin cases, we're going to check out two today for the iPhone 14 Pro Max. These cases are available for each new iPhone that did drop in September. These are from a company called Tech. I have two different cases here, one in matte black, one in a matte white and clear, super clean, really thin, and really nice. Now, Tech did provide these, but not a paid review. You guys will see this before they do. $29.50 is the price on the 2.0. Slight difference between the two and $22.50 for the standard 1.0 case. This does come in three colorways and the 2.0 does come in four colorways. We're gonna check it out. Let's check out the packaging real quick, guys. If you're new to the channel, hit that like, drop a sub. But let's check out the TAC Ultra Thin Cases. The packaging on here, very nice and very clean. I do like a very simple box. You guys know that. And you can see that beautiful matte finish on here. I love matte black on anything. If you follow the channel, you guys know that already. Now, check this matte black out. And how thin is this case? Now, again, this is a plastic case. $29 is the price on this guy here. And it does come in four different colorways. You can see on the sides, we do have the cutouts for all of the buttons, for the speakers, for the mute switch and the volume up and down. And then we have the precise cutouts for our camera lenses and it does fit very nicely over our lens. And it does give us a bit of protection. You can see it does give us a bit of a raised lip here on our camera lenses. Always a good thing. And there's a slight raised lip on the front. But let's throw this in and take a look and see the fit. Now, precise fit on here. Again, very lightweight as I drop the phone. 0.35 millimeters thin. So you can see here, you can't, it doesn't even look like I have a case on it. So very thin and very lightweight. Now, depending on which model of phone you have, that will determine the weight of the actual case, anywhere between six and nine grams. So very lightweight. If you don't like those big bulky cases, this might be a good case to go to. Now this will give you some scratch protection, very little drop protection. Just keep that in mind. If you drop your phone, if you're clumsy or whatever, and you need that drop protection, or you just wanna feel safe with a thicker case, this might not be the way to go. But if you're like me, and you want it to be as thin as possible and to protect against scratching and just look clean and feel like you don't have a case on it, then these are a perfect way to go in my opinion. And that matte black on here is fire. That thing looks super clean. I love that there's no branding on the back of this case. Really nice. The cutouts are perfect and precise, of course. Cutouts on the bottom for your speakers and your charging port and then the mute switch and the volume up and down. Now we can see here the slight raised lip over our camera lenses. Now the difference between this case here, the 1.0 and the 2.0 is the camera. We have an open cutout here on the 1.0 and then they changed it here for the 2.0. Now one added thing that we're gonna talk about on 2.0 is this does come with a magnet for MagSafe. And we'll put this on in a little bit after we take a look at the 1.0. But this magnet will go on the back of here and it will allow you to connect to accessories, right? Without this, you can still use the case and it will charge wirelessly with MagSafe, no issues at all. But if you wanna use like a car charger in your car where it's sitting up like that, then you're gonna to wanna to use this magnet. And I kinda of like the look of that, but we'll throw that on and see how it is. And it does make the connection much stronger if we use it. Now we'll check out the 1.0. Again, 2250, this one does come in three colorways. And look at that beautiful matte frosted clear. It could be a matte white or it could be just like a frosted clear, but that thing is clean. Which, what do you like better, guys? You like the matte black? or that matte white, that clear frost on there. I like them both. I think I prefer matte black in everything, but this is fire as well. Now you can see the difference. Now these are made out of the same materials. And again, the weights will vary depending on what model of phone you do have. Price 2250. The only difference here with this case is the open cutout. So we have the lenses, just to cut out for the lenses here, and then the open cutout standard 2.0 standard 1.0 we'll throw this on and see how it looks now these these are a good fit like this is on there pretty good but we'll try and see which one looks better so you can see that white that looks clean looks clean i think i like the black better 
but it does look pretty good. What do you guys think, man? Which one do you like better? Again, very thin. If you like that, that minimalistic look on your device, this is a perfect way to go. And again, these are available in different colors. They're available for each new phone in the iPhone 14 lineup. And I believe they're available also for older iPhones as well. Now, let's talk about this black case. So let's take this off and we're gonna throw the MagSafe magnet on. Now, I don't think I would use this personally. I like that it's here, but I don't think if I use this case, I might take this off or maybe I'll leave it on, I don't know. But I'm just gonna take this off. I'm gonna peel this. Now, real quick, before I show you this, we're gonna get the MagSafe charger and I'll show you that it does work with that. So let's bring that in. So here is the MagSafe. You can see it does start charging, but it doesn't really stick to it, right? And this is heavy. This is this base is very heavy, made out of steel. So that's a heavy base, but it's not gonna move. But if we put the magnet on it, Now, once we place this on the back, this will make it usable for accessories and give it that strong connection, that strong magnet, so it doesn't fall. Now, again, this thing is super heavy right here. This is the Nomad base station that goes with MagSafe, and this thing is solid, very heavy. Now, watch this. So you can see we are charging again, but watch this. It picks it up. That's how strong of a connection we have with the magnet. It picks it up. And I'm not holding it, you guys can see. That thing is strong, makes it very strong, and it still will come off. Put it on, it will charge, and then we can just take it off. Or, you can literally pick it up. Literally pick it up, watch. Crazy how strong that is. And I do kind of like the look of that on the back. I didn't think I would, but I do. Now when you place this on, you really don't have to worry about putting it in the wrong spot either because the magnets inside of the phone will just kind of grab it and then it will place it right where it needs to be. So very cool. I do like that. Maybe I'll keep that on there for now. But let me know which one you like better. The Matte Black 2.0 for 29 bucks that comes with this attachment for MagSafe. Or do you like the standard 1.0, 22.50, three colorways, four colorways. That's it, two new cases from Tech. Again, available for each iPhone, each new iPhone and some older iPhones. I will drop the links, hit that like, drop a sub. I'll be back soon, peace.